so this was the first butterfly pillow that I had. Um, it's been washed and it it, uh, it broke in the middle, but it actually made it really comfy because your head just sat between there. But the problem with it was uh, when the cover was washed, the cover shrank, which meant that this got really tight uh, and it made it a lot stiffer and harder than it should be. So I had to throw the cover away and now it can't be washed. So that's why we've replaced it. And this is the replacement. Um, now I will continue to buy butterfly pillows uh, for the rest of my life because I just find them to be the most comfy pillow uh, that you can use. Uh, and there's lots of reasons for that. You, your arm goes under the crook nicely. It, it's just it's just everything about it in all honesty. Right, so there's the pillow. And before we put it together, here's the right upon it. So it's a neck support pillow and it's got a, a thermoactive cover on it. It's allergy friendly. It is comfortable. I guarantee that. Honestly, these are so worth the price. If you've never used one, absolutely fantastic. Much better than these, this type. I've tried this type before um, and I find the butterfly pillow to be much better. Uh, and it's regulates its temperature so let's pop that to one side let's take this off don't need that what you do need however is you need to allow it to expand which you can see it doing there now here we bought two because they're that good. So my daughter's been using this one. And as you can see, it's quite a bit more expanded than that. So that will, move that to one side, that will expand more. And as you saw with the other one, there's the cover that goes onto it. And it's a zip cover there. So nice and easy to put on. Right, this is the word of warning. The last one we had, it shrank and as I said what it did was it just made this firmer and I, I wasn't getting as comfy as a good night's sleep so I recommend that you wash this very carefully so that there's no shrinking anyway let's uh let's pop this in I'd wanted a, a memory foam pillow for ages and I'll show you one that I bought I don't use it to actually go to sleep on but I do use it if I'm uh, sat up in bed watching TV or reading. Uh, and basically the reason I don't use it in bed is it, it's just way too supportive. But if we have a look at this now, just look at how you just sink into that. And how it slowly expands. Really, really cool. As I say, so worth the money that we, we bought two of them. And this one's been in use. It's going to be a sad day when I throw this away. In fact... If somebody invented a pillow and started marketing it with that in the middle, that you'd make a fortune. So that's pretty much expanded. I'm going to leave that now. And I will just show you that other pillow. So this is it. This was the first one that I got. And as you can see, it's a, a tempo, tempo pillow. Um, it's, it's very soft, but it's just, it's just too... It's too big that way, so your neck's not at all comfy when you're laid on it. Great, great. It's a great for if you sat up, but not if you laid down. Just look at the difference in those. And this, as I say, what, what happens is you put your arm underneath it and then your, your head rests on top. It's just really, really comfy. So that is a huge recommendation. Well worth the buy. Right, so in summary, this is the Cassimum Pillow. It's an ergonomic butterfly pillow. It's the most comfortable pillow you will ever use. Uh, for this one, I paid around about 40 pounds. The previous one to this, it was about 70 pounds that I paid. Um, and if you look for these, I don't know how I managed to get this for this price, to be honest with you, because they're still around 60 or 70 pounds. But fantastic, well worth it. You can see how soft it is there. And again, 
the way I use it, get rid of all the other pillows, and then that just goes under the crook of my arm, and then my head goes on there. Big, big recommendation.